Hi, welcome to Melissa is a Dork. I'm Melissa and I'm a Dork. This one's dedicated to all the hackers. Hi everybody, I'm Steve Hofstetter. I'm Melissa Archer. Now, you probably knew at least one of those things because this is on both of our channels. But this video is about jailbreaking phones. Yes, and I'm going to teach Steve here how to jailbreak an iPhone 6. I do not even know what that means. Yes, it's gonna be great. First of all, I've heard a lot about jailbreaking. What is the- Basically, Apple locks down the phones pretty well, and so you can't really customize, you can't theme, you can't get into system settings and change any of those things. So if you want to be able to do that, then you have to root your phone. And once it's jailbroken, you go into the App Store Cydia, and you can download tweaks from there. And you can purchase them, or some of them are free, and that way you can do all sorts of neat, fun stuff to your phone. Are we gonna get in trouble for this video? No, we are not going to get in trouble for this video. Is jailbreaking illegal? Jailbreaking is not illegal on an iPhone. I'm not sure because I haven't checked the laws lately, but um, I know at one point it was illegal on the iPad. But we're not doing that. So we're okay, we're not gonna break the law. We're not gonna break the law. We're just gonna break the phone. Just this phone, phone is already broken. Can we <laughs> zoom in on that? Sorry. Why do I get the cracked one? I, I think that might be another episode. All right. I'm gonna have to fix the screen. How to give Steve bum phones? Yes. All right. Um, go to Pangu. P A N G U dot I O. Okay. And then you're gonna go to download and help, and you're just gonna hit the download button. All right, easy so far. Yep. Click Cydia Impactor and Mac OS. So just go ahead and download. Boom. Open Cydia Impactor. Yes, it was downloaded from the internet. That's where Don't stuff be lives. I can't wait till I accidentally click on something that people aren't supposed to see on this thing. If you are a developer, you can put this in and it'll last for a year. That's a long password right here. I felt bad because this one's not cracked and I could have given it to you. Oh, well. That's fine. I'll just use so, the cracked one because that's what you think of me. <laughs> yeah, look. Pengu came up. It's in between all of these cracks. <laughs> there it is. All right, let's allow the notifications. And then, press start to jailbreak. Please lock screen and wait a few seconds. So... What? Perfect! Was that quick? It's restarting. You see all the nice cracks in the lovely <laughs> wallpaper? <laughs> Decided to unlock. Hopefully not cutting my finger. There's Cydia. Cydia. Mm -hmm. So... Click on Cydia. I would call this Cydia. But I don't know things. So it's reloading the data. The new screens are coming up. At this point, I wouldn't even know if this is Russians making my Twitter into a tweet factory. This is how little I know of this. So I hit confirm. Now it's running a lot of matrix looking code. <laughs> Loading data. Done with the packages. So I'm gonna sign into my Facebook. Hey everybody, do you wanna know my Facebook password? Well, you're not gonna. I spelled my own name wrong. Figured. Yeah. I'm bad at stuff. There you are. Look, I'm here, it's me. What is I caught you pro? Oh, that one's cool. If someone steals your phone, if they put in like the wrong password or whatever, it takes a picture of the person's face and then it emails it to you. And that way, if you don't have your phone but you have your email, you can, you'll see the person who stole your phone. That's amazing. Right? Okay, this is, that is the coolest thing I've heard. What's blocked? Blocked is the tweak that Nikias and I did together. Um, so that one will allow you to go in and you can force a passcode lock so that if you have it already on fingerprint and say you fall asleep, whether yeah. it's at home or on a plane or whatever, it, people can't just use your fingerprint and open up your phone. That also will lock it from them being able to access the control panel and you reconfigure the settings. It's yeah. also good if you wanted to like, because you could set it as a trigger where you could quickly put it into that if say you were pulled over, I'm not advocating obstruction of justice, but. If someone wanted to force you to unlock your phone. Oh, with your fingerprint, for. yeah. And so, and also, and there's guest mode in block, so if someone wants to borrow your phone, you trigger it into guest mode, and you can pre-configure it where you can literally have them only be able to access the dial pad, and nothing else even in the phone app, or you can leave certain things open that they can access. Oh, that's a cool uh, piece of software. Thanks. So here's a question for you. Mm -hmm. At what point, while you were starring on Days of Our Lives, where you're like, I'm gonna jailbreak phones. 
Um, actually, it was on my left leg when I started doing that. Fair. Okay, you know what? That's the right answer to that question. <laughs> While you're on one life to live. Yeah. You were like, there's a lot of downtime on this set. <laughs> so now look, blocked comes up. How do you turn blocked off? If you have it in passcode lock and or force passcode lock and you want to go back to touch ID, it just do that trigger again. Okay. It should go back to normal. So now I'm putting this in guest mode. Oh, look at that. Blocked, enabled. That's insane. So I dragged along the side and now I went into the phone and look. They can use your phone, but there's no favorites, recents, contacts, voicemail, just the keypad. So if someone's like, hey, can I use your phone? And you're afraid that they're gonna do horrible things with it, well, now you can stop them. That's amazing. Well, congratulations. How do you feel? Uh, I feel good. Yeah? Yeah. Feel powerful? I feel very powerful. I feel customizable. Mm -hmm. um, that was kind of awesome. And I know that this video is a great departure from what I normally do on this channel, but I figured she's showing me cool stuff, so I wanted to show it to you guys too. And if this, if you're watching this on Melissa's channel, it's a huge departure from what I do on that channel, because <laughs> I'm, not, never been on the I'm channel. not on that channel. Thanks Thank for coming to be on the show. Thanks for having me, even though this is my house. <laughs> right. Okay, good point. I'm just waiting till my blackberry dies Cause I'll replace it with the raspberry pie Don't compare it to this track It makes everything they said dull Neutralize any